Right now, this is the tumor, and this is the anteroposterior as well as the vertical sections of the tumor. And we have got the angio MR angio also. Now, what we will do is we are going to get an OAM image of this uh, patient, and with the OAM image, we are going to fuse. I mean, uh, with the auto registration, we can fuse this OAM image with the MRI, and we will know what kind of bone removal we will need to do. We have the navigable microscope and the intraoperative MRI as well as the scope ready. So we're going to be what we're going to be doing is uh, we're going to fuse the MR images with the OAM and the angio, so that we exactly know uh, at each point of time where exactly the vessels are when we are doing this scan. So that's the IDA system and the roof-mounted uh, I7 navigation. It's a pack system seen there. Using the electromagnetic uh, navigation for this uh, small child with a third ventricular tumor. So that's a theater. And uh, we have the scope ready. We have the Carl Stoltz uh, spice camera scope ready. And that's a Mitaka arm. Can you show the Mitaka arm, uh, Jag Jagadish? That's a metaka arm on which the scope will rest. And that's a craniotomy. And that's where the navigation is going to happen. And that's a roof-mounted I-7 navigation. The EM uh, I mean receiver is here. We, in case of intraoperative imaging required, we have the IMRI as well as the OAM. And that's the pentero, which is going to come in. So uh, the pentero, as well as the scope, the Carlstow scope is ready for this. So we can uh, use, we can do a multi-port or same port surgery using both.